the most commonly applied for power banks is 18,650 Li on round cell. 18 stands for 18 mm in outer diameter, and 65 for 65 mm in length. 0 means the cylindrical configuration. By the way, the regular capacity of a Li ion battery cell is around 2,260 to 3,600 mAh. Hence it's easy to deduce whether the claimed capacity is real or fake by the size of the power bank. As the 18,650 batteries are covered by metal shell, explosion would be triggered by overpressure. Here is an oxygen atom. A group of oxygen atoms. Here is a cobalt atom. Make a combination. Here is a Li ion. Insert it in. Here comes the positive pole. The negative pole consists of carbon atoms. There are many small holes for the insertion of Li ion. That composes the negative pole. The poles are both wrapped with a layer of thin film, which is called SEI equals solid electrolyte interface. SEI separate the positive and negative poles to reduce the risk of short circuit and help Li ion pass through. Li ion will go out from positive pole while charging. Passing through SEI then get to the small holes at negative pole. Li ion will come back to positive pole while discharging. Battery is filled with electrolyte which act as the carriers to transfer Li ion. When battery heat and temperature keeps going high, and reach a certain level, SEI will start decompose, which will result in the full exposure of poles and decomposition of electrolyte along with much heat. As the internal temperature keeps going up, the active substance at positive pole will resolve along with a huge amounts of heat and oxygen gas. Then. Overcharging, high current flow both are the main triggers to explode. It's necessary to put more protective measures on batteries. Overcharging precaution will stop the charging operation when the power bank is fully charged. Short circuit precaution will cut off the current flow once any short circuit is formed.